uh, Mr. Iftikal, protocol observed. Ladies and gentlemen, assalamu alaikum. First, I want to thank all of you for coming today to witness what has been constructed here and to thank those people who have come up with such a, a very wonderful development. Let us put our hands together and we clap for them. I want to thank you people of Pakistan for welcoming me here for the second time. Remember last time I was here and as welcomed by all of you in such a wonderful way. Thank you so much for hosting us. Today again I've come back and uh, I've been escorted by, my delegation has my daughter, she's, a, she's called Joey, she's a student, but she said she wanted to see Pakistan, like Ugandans. I want to thank OPJF, we were that is ground we did groundbreaking of this hospital of this health center it was a ground breaking ceremony today it is officially opening this wonderful health facility so i want to thank opjf i want to thank the people of pakistan especially the people of this village uh, the name? Talwandi Musa Khan. Talwandi. Musa. Yeah, the people of this village. Because according to him, he was saying 50 people, patients, are being treated here every day. Is it true? Yes, yes, it is true. That is one of let us clap for ourselves. Which means these 50 people per day, they had nowhere to go. And because of the development these people have brought, now the service has come nearer to us. So we thank them so much. Their little money that they are making in Uganda, they've decided to share with you people, the brothers and sisters, uncles of these people. They are not only sharing with you here, but they are also sharing with us in Uganda. Because in most cases, when we get foreigners to come to our countries, they make their money and they go with it. But this is different from these people who are here. They make the money, then they leave it in Uganda because they have done many developments in our country. On addition to that, then they bring and share with you. Because they would have decided just to stay in Uganda because that is where they are spending most of their time and lives with their families. But we thank them that they did not forget home and they did not forget where they are staying. That is wonderful. I thank you, OP Jeff, and I thank Mr. Iftikar with your team for all that you have done. There are many things that they have done and of course they've been talking about them like uh, the eye care, that cataract uh, program they've been doing, donation of blood they have been doing, giving ambulances to many people, not only you but even in Uganda they've given ambulances, they've given to Kenya, they've given to Tanzania, all that is uh, donation work 
and we thank them. We pray that may the Almighty reward them abundantly. And all that is free service. It is free service which is not being uh, paid for. I don't want to say much, just to thank you. I've come here and I'm going to attend the exhibition also in Lahore. The people of Pakistan are good. We have some students who are coming to study from Lahore. All that is hospitality of the people of Pakistan. So I want to thank you by... So, so, so I'm um, concluding by officially handing over the health center to the people of Pakistan, especially the ones in this village, and officially handing over the ambulance, which these uh, um, services have been delivered or have been donated by OPJF overseas pakistan global foundation africa headed by iftikal zishan it is a big team i cannot mention all of them but it's a big team so they call the overseas pakistan global foundation africa we thank you so much for that program i want to stop there and i want to thank my sisters my, brother, my brothers, my daughters, and everybody who are here today. Last time, these ones were not here, but today they are with us. I thank you. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Thank you so much. Thank you so much.